I apologize for the delay of taking my sweet ass time getting ready this morning. Hi, everybody. How is everybody? How shall we do? My webcam is rather dark. Well, it's blind to fig. Let me fix this. Hold on. Try to make things the more coat nice and you know how that be. Sometimes things. Always working though. Is that okay? My screen still seems rather dark. I suppose this is fine. And then this just falls over. Oh boy. Um. Okay, switch to the game screen. Figure this out. Good way to start the day. Hi, everybody. Also, if you did, um, I also moved my desk early six inches to the six inches, right? In my apartment, for the sake of cord ease. And several things had to get moved around to make up for that, and so forgive things being a little bit weird. good. That should be good. Those cords can go away because that's from my work laptop. Are we plugged in? No game. Would you like to respond to my controller inputting? You would? Okay. So last time... We got to a part of the game that I completely forgot about. I forgot, I, I, I literally forgot that there was other shit in between the two bosses on Gagazette. So... There's just these, like, really odd trials just, like, hanging out here. Like, yeah, we're here. Uh, Lou and Yuna could definitely use some more health, so, like, if I get a chance and I get some, like, HP spheres... I hope I can get my hands on some HP spheres, because I would like to give them some extra bonus health. Okay. Like, why is everything just immune to, to slow? He is immune to darkness. That's a lot of damage. Yeah, it is an ugly thing. We are almost to Xanarkand. No, like, the behemoths. I bet he's immune to power break, too. Oh, no, he's not. Perfect. That's grand. 
Let's end this quickly. That's actually super grand and super will help. Baka, you're really like completely useless here, aren't you? Yeah, I mean, if he's gonna be immune. Yeah, at this point, he was just a one-hit KO. Thankfully, we have Riku with alchemy, so any, um... I foresee no difficulty. Any Phoenix down is just a, is a full life. I'm not sure. I think, Kamari can learn... I think Kamari can learn a thing from this guy, so we're gonna see Cannon, and then it's next turn we're gonna... We're gonna, we're gonna see. I literally need to protect. Halt physical might. I'm gonna use protect on you, because she literally cannot handle like one of like anything. Yep. Okay, so he has like 5k left in health. He was just very annoying. Because it's super okay. Because we like have the answer to any of our dudes any of our dudes like dying at all. There we go. The most annoying thing about people dying is the fact that is the fact that they lose their um What the hell are you still like Why is it still telling me to go that way? I don't believe that's right. Yeah, it's just... I think it's just pointing out the stairs to me. Um, no elemental weaknesses uh, resistant to physical attacks. I believe... Yeah, Armor Break just lets us do regular physical damage to him, thankfully. Wow! Say, is that edible? <laughs> wow! So is that edible? <laughs> Love Riku's lines. Riku has some, like, great lines. Just pretty much making sure, like, everyone gets in a move here.
Then we use like the opposite of a spell we actually care about at all. Well, I'll ever swap back to Waka and sign let's buster it again. Oh, White Wind. That's a lancetable skill. I actually should bring out Titus, because Titus is the one that, uh, his overdrives care about him attacking. White Wind is a weird healing spell, because it heals you for how much health you have. That's how it's done. Okay. Also, hi, Paz. How are you? Can I haste? Yeah, I can't haste. Sw Dude, I'm a bit tired because I decided to build the shelf at like 10.30 and I ended up staying up till midnight. But I ended up staying up till like 1.30 and still woke up at 8. I was like, I completely forgot I had a coffee, and then realized that I drank all of it while watching Sean's stream. I believe that you played Persona 5 Dancing for like, for like nine hours yesterday, Fuzz. That sounds, that sounds like, a, that sounds accurate. <sighs> These things are kind of a pain, but like... I should probably still, like... I should probably still fight them. I don't want to, like... I don't want to, like, overuse Lulu and Yuna's magic on non, like, boss fights as much as I can. Like, I think the plan, like, for the rest of this cave is literally gonna be, like... Yuna and Lulu will, like, still be around and still be able to... Jesus, this guy's just gonna keep down in Kamari. And then just come in and, like, expect some combination of Lulu, Orin... Of, um... Titus, Orin, Waka, and Kamari to deal with the, uh, so be it. actually attack. <laughs> Orin can actually survive this, but he doesn't. You definitely want to use a Phoenix down on Orin because he has, like, a million health. How many steaks you think we can get out of these? Yeah. Oh, Waka. Yeah, a regular attack for once is actually great. You can use your magic, it doesn't do that much against me. Uh, I want to steal a, I want to steal a, um, Lunar Curtain. Oh, we got a Mana Tablet. Mana Tablet's really good.
Wait, did I go the wrong way? I'm confused. Pretty certain there is a second trial I need to do before the game will let me escape. Yeah, it was okay. So you can, so you can kind of cheat here. Did they're basically just the colors that they are on the sphere grid are the correct colors. If you could stop that, that would be great. Also, can I say I never want to hear the Whims of Fate remakes ever again? Oh, just because of the uh, number of times you've heard it trying to, trying to play uh, dancing? Okay, no, I think we did it. I didn't like it before after failing to get a King Crazy for half an hour during it, it makes me angry. Is King Crazy just like a full combo in that game? Come with no nice notes and all and all scratches hit perfectly. Oh, so basically either great or or perfect. Great or perfect. And all scratches hit on great or perfect. When I played, I got the full combo with one of the scratches I hit a second too early and counted as a nice, so I got a brilliant with one note off. Fuck. That sucks. So we're basically, we're fleeing here because I don't... I don't really want them to get better stats than everybody else. I'd rather just fight the fights where I have a full party. I love it, like, all throughout this dungeon, they're just, like, trying to figure out a way, like, how are we going to defeat Sin without using the final Aeon? Oops, I need piercing on that. I literally was about to swap out Riku because she's hurt, and I'm just like, why don't we just high potion? That deals that gives me 2k back. <laughs> yeah, 
And this barely matters. Charging. Perfect. Um, I suppose, like, I should just, like, get, you know, in with a, uh, you know, should, like, do something? I think I've had everyone hit the boss at this point, hit, hit the enemies at this point. Oh, he is resistant to magic, I'm dumb. Yeah, I'm done. Booyah. Hey, here we go. The encounter rate in these last couple of areas has been insanely high, and I don't know why. Thousand Jeesh. Riku's pretty much taken the role of like secondary healer at this point, and I'm always in for it. Um, we can bring in Kamari to take it to throw a hit at him. basically just looking to spread it out. Thankfully, the amount of um, experience that our, that our party gets has nothing to do with the, um, with the, with the levels that we get and stuff like that. Your rain's great. Farewell. There we go. Orin's like beefy, beefy AF right now. It might be worth actually bringing Titus over to Orin's side of the uh, sphere grid. Be, upon us soon. be insane. Um... She has sent fiends to test our summoner's strength. Who is she? Unaleska. Lady Unaleska. In Xanarkin, she awaits the arrival of the strongest. She is still alive? As much as Micah and Seymour. I see. Lost your nerve? No. Nothing frightens me now. Yeah. Braska would be proud. Then I must not let him down. That's to warn you. 
Oh, see, this is okay. Um, let's just say this boss is a fucking time. And there's sort of a cheese run, uh, there, there's sort of a cheese strat that we're gonna be using. Because it's the... Because it's... Because... With... Without it, this boss is kind of bullshit. Do you have to, like, go through all of this stuff to, like, get to... To get to and beat him normally? I do have a level 4 key sphere. Honestly, I think it's more important we get Lulu, Lulu double cast. Then they get zombie attack. I think is like double cast is yeah, double cast is right here. Because we need a level three, a level four, and a level three and a level four to get her there. Well, we're almost there, so like I can check to see if I have a level three. I don't have any level threes. Fuck, I need a level three. Nice. To check to see how I can get a level three key sphere. Ruins off a of Defender Z. The uncommon drop from this mob, the rare drop from him is level. In the ruins dome, the interior, there's a level three as well. So, yeah, when we get um, Defender Z, when we get past this boss, when we get to actually get to Xanderkin, we'll be stopping a bit to grind on a few Defender Z's, because we are going to need a lot of Key Spheres coming up. Because we need a three pretty much to get everybody off of their route and onto somebody else's route almost entirely. Because we can, we can use these uh, Return Spheres and Teleport Spheres to kind of do a lot of the work for us, but... I honestly used to use these two teleport spheres to um, teleport to Ultima or to full life and teleport back, but I don't do that anymore. I don't do that anymore. Because I think full life is, um, 
Okay, where is full life? Quick pockets? I don't remember that being there before. Yeah, so we have, um, yeah, we have one level four sphere, and we need a level four sphere to get full life, but, like, um, we're gonna have some places a little later on while we're grinding for, um, while we're grinding for stuff to get that back. And like we may we may honestly just for Titus, we may just grind the sphere levels to put him back here. To put him around here, and then use a level three to get him onto Orin's route, and then put Orin through here. I mean put Orin like through here to get Haste, Hasty Aga, Sloga, all that stuff. Give him the quick hit, go back through here, go like kinda through here, go up through here, and, and go up through here, and into where and into um and into Waka section is usually what I like to do with Orin, but um Cause Orin can definitely cause Orin's like weakness is he needs more agility. I usually like to give him, um, Do I usually like to give him Tidus's root after. And then Waka takes Orin's root. A lot of people benefit from going on Tidus's root, because Tidus's root provides decent amounts of strength, um, decent MP, uh, haste, which is really good, slow, which is, like, good to have on as many people as you want. And the agility, obviously. His agility is really... His his agility, while well, not the highest, because Waka is the, Waka and Rikis are the highest, his agility is still very good. So, um... A lot of your characters benefit from having that. Okay. It comes! This guy is very dangerous. This is why. Because, like, he has Confusion, Darkness, his Photon Wings, Confusion, Darkness, um, Silence, and also this new, um, and also this new, uh, status that prevents you from getting Overdrive. Oh yeah, and also Sleep. Two haste is going to be insanely important. Also, Yuna having haste is going to be insanely important later on, too. So, to get rid of the status, we actually have to dispel. But doing this is way more important first. We won't be using Lulu a lot during this fight because of this strategy, but...
This is why having a second party member with haste is like really useful. We gotta get Kamari out of here eventually though. down. I'm not sure if this status resets upon death, though. Okay, it does. It does reset upon death, thankfully. I don't remember if he is weak, if he had, if he is vulnerable to slow. Shit, I forgot about... I forgot about Reflect. This is part of the reason why having Reflect on the boss is so important, because he will use Protect on himself, but we really don't want him to have Protect. We really don't want him to have Protect. Protect sucks, to deal with. I don't know if he's actually weak to... Okay. I'd much rather get it on my random dudes that does nothing than have the boss have protect on him. Oh yeah, I forgot, that status lets you not use your- also just says, yeah, about your overdrives? No, you can't even use it. Fuck your overdrives. You wanted to use those? Ah, fam. We gotta put Lulu in, and she has to get an attack in, but Lulu's gonna be useless here because of the reflect strategy. So Lulu's coming out, and she's never co On her next turn, Lulu's coming out, and she'll never come back into this fight. Lou's never coming back in. I think Albed potions can deal with some of this. It's pointless silence and petrification. So with everybody's health being as well, Idis's health is the only one that's really low. I think we can afford to throw in Yuna here. Gonna Asuna. Let's do the Titus, because having sleep sucks, because sleep literally means you can't do anything. We have Orin just remedy himself here. I just like immediately uh, re haste him. Okay, we should heal Titus now. The boss is having his turn next, so I don't want to chance Titus dying. I don't have to. has haste right now. Right, Kamari, I keep forgetting Kamari has that status and I haven't had a chance to take, take him out of that status yet.
I fucked it up by pre by like pressing A too many times. Okay, he's almost dead, actually, so. We're gonna grand summon Bahama and they should kill him. Mega Flare should kill him from here. Because if we if we just attack him, uh, we, we risk letting him continue to, to do his uh, ultimate attack and potentially cure himself even after the reflect. So I don't want to chance anything. I'd rather grind Bahamut's Overdrive again later than risk risk him getting another attack in. Mega Flare can go over the damage limit, so by default. Yeah, 14 grand. I may be a bit over leveled right now. That boss is usually harder. for a bit soon means that there's not much time left there's not Riku. fine I'll think on the way Return sphere. Two return spheres are really good too. Hey, come on, let's go. We are. We're almost there, aren't we? <sighs> We've come a long way. Sure have. What's so funny? You remind me of myself. Hmm? Before, the closer I came to Xanarkin, the more I wondered. When we arrive, Brasco will call the final Aeon. He will fight Sin. Then die. I thought my mind was made up long before. But when I stood here, my resolve wavered. Hmm. Never would have figured. Legendary guardians choke sometimes too, yeah? <laughs> Legendary guardian? I was just a boy. A boy about your age, actually. I wanted to change the world too. But I changed nothing. That is my story. I always thought I would love to get a Final Fantasy game where you get to play at, where you get to do, where you actually get to do Brasco's journey. But, it, but like the argument that usually comes across when I express that opinion is that, well, the story is rather explored already. So, and. That is completely right. That the story is for a thousand years. The story is already pretty explored. It would a just city be cool. I had to see with my own eyes. The end of Yuna's journey. The last chapter in my story. My thoughts, they kept floating up and then slipping through my fingers, slipping away before I could pin them down with words. Yuna, I say no. If we go down there, then you'll...
There's got to be another way. Riku, you're a true friend, and I thank you, but I must go down to Sanarkand. I'm not saying we shouldn't go, but should we think about it some more? There's got to be some kind of way we can save you, Yuna. All my life, I knew this moment would come. Uni. <sighs> Thank you, Riku. Thank you for everything. Don't say that, Uni. Not over yet. You're... It's not over yet. Just maybe we can still find a way. Maybe we can still Please. find a way. Uni, don't say that because we're gonna see each other again, okay? Kimari, let's go. This is one of those instances where living in the future kind of sucks for the plot of this game. So we know Final Fantasy X2 ex Ten Two exists, and we know because of the box art and the promotional material that Yuna doesn't die. But Sir Oren, you know, Kimari told me when my father wanted me taken from Bavel to Besaid, it was you who told Kimari, right? I had always wanted to meet you someday. I am truly glad that I had that chance. Having you as a guardian was so great an honor. I don't know how to thank you. This is kind of Perhaps a sad scene. If I defeat Sin, that will be my thanks to you. That's what I'll do. Yes. I will challenge Sin. I will defeat Sin. If you are all there watching this, then I guess Sin is already gone. And so am I. I suppose. <laughs> anyway, I just wanted to say, Sir Orin, uh, I thank you. Kimari, <laughs> do you remember the first day we met? I was only seven. My father had defeated Sin, and all Bavel was celebrating. Everyone was saying what a hero my father was. I was so happy. But when night came, it occurred to me. My father had defeated Sin, and now he was dead. Now I was all alone. I couldn't sleep. I also so didn't I turn my... Into the town. I also didn't Away turn my close captains on. Oops. I stood on the bridge me. in Bavel, where my father and I had parted. Standing there, alone, I could see the fields where he had fought Sin. Then, you appeared, Kamari. You said you were looking for the daughter of Raska, remember? At first, I was so scared. Until I realized what a gentle person you are. <laughs> you weren't used to talking to children. When I told you that I was Braska's daughter, you said you would take me as far from Bavel as you could. That it was the wish of a man facing death. I think I cried then. Because that... That was when I knew my father was dead, and I would never see him again. You just held me, without saying a word. I cried after we got to Besaid, too. When you tried to go, after leaving me in the care of the temple, I held on to you crying, don't go, don't go. And you listened, Kimari. You stayed, Kimari. 
Thank you. Oh, it's so sad. Thank you so much. And I've always liked your broken horn. Waka, Lulu. I'll never forget my days spent with you, growing up in Besaid. We always played together, us and Chapu. That's why I was always so happy, I think. And when you refused to let me become a summoner, and I did it anyway, I'm sorry. I've always wanted to apologize. You know, when you tried to stop me then, really, I was happy. I could tell you really cared about me. You so were like sad. my big brother and sister. No, I think you really were my big brother and sister. What else? <laughs> I love watching you play Blitzball, Waka. <laughs> I even love it when you scold me, Lulu. <laughs> really? I guess that leaves the newest guardian. Star player of the Xanarkand Apes. I you cheat. I changed my settings so that wouldn't happen. I am... Well, um... I'm glad... I'm glad that we met. We haven't even known each other that long, but... It's funny. So... So this is what it feels like. It's a much more wonderful feeling than anything I had ever imagined. Wonderful. But it hurts sometimes. Mm. Mm. I wonder. I... <laughs> I just want to say thank you for everything. He basically admits that she was in love with... She, like... Maybe, maybe that's why it hurts. He's basically admitting that and she, I, like... Kinda has a crush on Titus the whole entire time. When I think about us never being together again at all. Which is kinda I'm sad. Afraid. Which is really sad. No, I shouldn't say that. I'll do that part over. Um. What you up to? And it's sad because then with that part you like realize she's kind of just like leaving her last will, her her like last testament, or her guardians for when she dies from defeating sin. This is what's left of Xanarkand. Nothing but a washed up city, been... Destroyed a thousand years ago. And then we get to replay the scene from the beginning of the game, recontextualized. And it kind of does just recontextualize how miserable. Hey, look at the scene. Yeah, yeah, it's the scene from the beginning of the game. So basically, Titus has been telling the story of their journey 
while they're standing right here waiting to go to Xanarkin. Because I know that Xanarkin is the end of the journey. Also, it's a very beautiful song. Listen to my story. This may be our last chance. There was more, right? I mean, like that time. Uh, anyone? I think... Yes? I think that we should stop. Maybe. For now. He's just recanting their story. Over the campfire, waiting to go to Sanderkin. Here we are, finally at Sandrikin. After 25 hours, we're back. So, this part contains some of the hardest enemies in the game. Except for one area that you can get to later, once you get through this part. I forget if this guy's like. This is the guy who didn't. Uh, who Sleep Buster. like, uh, Dark Buster didn't affect him. I believe. I still want to attack with everybody because we want to make sure everyone gets. Pretty even sphere levels from here. There's some really great shit you can steal from these enemies in this area, too. We're just attacking with Lulu because we don't want to just. Just tons of MP at this point, but we don't want to be squandering her MP. Because uh, against uh, opponents where the MP is really not going to be that big of a deal, where uh, where magic's not, where magic's like only fine. Everyone's got the turn, so now we can just slowly swap back to our physical attackers.
there's a certain enemy we want to steal. Want to steal from. I don't know if he, uh. Okay, he bis he doesn't resist all A Buster, that's good. We basically need a single level three. You shall fear magic. Once we get that level three, Lulu can get one of her best um her best skills in the whole game. Just double cast, which is insane. Because it basically allows her to cast two spells in one turn for absolutely no extra cost. It's just completely free. When she learns, um... When she learns white magic, you can even mix your magic. Like, any two spells. Like, you can just cast two. Now at this point, oh, um, oh, I, I, I swore somebody else was poisoned, but it's fine. It's hard trying to keep track of who has actually done stuff in every battle. We're just gonna cure her. Oh, I didn't use Riku. Oops. I need to remember to steal stuff because, like, some of the stuff we can steal in this uh, protection up to the temple is all really good and worth it, so I gotta remember to keep doing it. Looks like the far plane. Close enough. Armor, use his armor break on this guy, it means he's completely vulnerable to, mech, to physical attacks, just like he would have been normally. Ah, uh, that's very powerful. He does still completely resist magic, and I think, I'm not sure if, I'm honestly not sure if mental break actually does anything against him. However, we'll bring in Lulu back in to literally just hit an attack so she gets AP for this fight and then swap her back out on her next turn. Same with Lulu, same with Yuna. Do I care that they don't do a whole ton of damage? Not really. I want them to get I want them to get a AP for the fight. I really don't care. Remember to steal with Riku before we, um before I forget basically. Bring in Kamari. Um, I don't remember which which enemies in this part actually get actually have Lancet abilities. So now he's going to just keep white winding himself because he's almost dead. And obviously our physical attacks do more than what he was able to white win, so... White wind only, again, works for how much bat- how much, uh... 
how much health you actually have. Kidding me, Sunrise? Yeah, could Japan just not be pedos for like five seconds, please? Like, it's really hard to be a. It's really fucking hard to be a weeb sometimes and like look at anime seriously. Because there's always. Because there's always weird, creepy shit like this. God, I hate it. I know I probably care way too much for somebody who doesn't care as much about Inuyasha as you do, but I still hate it. Oh, you do. Yeah, I do care about anime's image, and anime's image needs to stop doing that shit. <laughs> That's fair. Um, we do need to watch something later today, because the first episode of the new season of Promise Neverland came out. And I know we've both read the manga, but I still want to, I, I still am like super in on still watching. Even though we, like, know what happens between now and the end of this. I'll probably end with Goldie Pond, but I still want to see it. I I apparently have been, I, I have been informed that they, like, skip two chapters in the first episode, but, it, but that it kind of makes sense for them to skip the chapters that they skipped. Because they're trying to get to a very specific thing that happens, like... Three or four chapters past where 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 the uh, where it ended last season. If if you know what I mean without me actually saying this, because I'm live onto it. Just use no. here, but I don't remember half the time what people are using or not. Okay, now is when we want to bring in Lulu. Because if we physically attack him with his dukes up like that, then he counterattacks and... Excuse me. Okay, he is, he is weak to fire. Got it. Just double checking before I waste mana. He just should be able to kill it with one with a physical strike. See ya. Yep. Still waiting to get that enemy that drops the oh shit. It drops a level three key spiritual targe. Charges are recouped. MP stroll. Doesn't fucking don't don't care. Doesn't do anything. Oh. 
Yeah, FBI. Uh, everyone's like, FBI, open up, Shishomaru. What the fuck are you doing? Hey, it's canon. No, do, do we care? No. Do we care that people think it's disturbing that that's an actual thing? No. It's just... It just... It just, like, reeks of, like... It's them, them doing that just reeks of, like, uh... What's the word I'm looking for? Yeah, grooming. It just reeks of grooming to me, and it's gross. Yeah, in a couple years she'll be 18, and then we can, then I can have her have my baby. And I'm like, why? Why do you do this, Anthony? This baffles me. I mean, keep. Can't get good rolls on these encounters like at all and get the one that I want. I am. Fl I'm gonna flee for this one. I think it's like out here that that like the. Uh... It's in the dome. Okay, sorry. Um, I'm. That's what. That's why I'm not getting the roll on the encounter. Because it's not in this screen. It's on the next screen. That's why I'm not getting the roll and getting the encounter that I want. Because it's not on this screen. That makes a lot of sense. I think there's a boss fight up here. I don't really super remember if there's a boss fight immediately. Journeyer of the long road, name yourself. I am the summoner Yuna. I have come from the island of Besaid. Your eyes, my dear, show me the long road you have traveled. Very good. You have journeyed well. Lady Unaleska will surely welcome your arrival. Go to her now, and bring your guardians with you. Go. Yes. I um, the solar, um, solar battery pack did you? Oh, actually, don't be Yeah, there's no way to plug in a phone in the 15 hours. I'll be right back to get my phone.
Okay. Thanks, thanks for your patience, everybody. I appreciate it. You know, when... when oh. might ask. Use my life, Lady Yoken, and rid Spira of sin. What? What was that? Our predecessors. She said Lady Yoken, didn't she? Wait, she guarded High Summoner Yoken? This dome is filled with fireflies. It's like one gigantic sphere. People's thoughts remain here. Forever. Also, I'm just noticing this, and like, I know this is probably more of a, just like an anime thing in, in this game. I, I just noticed in this playthrough how many shots there just are of Lulu's boobs, and I'm just like, come on, like, do you do you like need like it's not like super frequent or anything, but it's like just frequent enough that it's noticeable, and I'm just like, come on. All right. Rare steel is a uh, rare steel on Defender Z is a uh, level three key spheres. Is it steel or is it um, bride? Let me just double check. Common steel, rare steel, common drop. Oh, it's a rare drop. It's not a steel. Okay, it's a drop. I mean, so we kill it, it gets that. This ends now. Mental break works well. Okay. Hope we get a level three key sphere out of this thing so I can teach a uh, Lulu double cast. The thunder he's weak against? No, nah, I mean he doesn't have a weakness, I guess. But apparently he's super vulnerable. Apparently, uh, the game says yeah he's vulnerable to magic. I'm like okay, whatever you say, game. Cure us. Orin's like the only one that I specifically have to use Kyrgyz on when he goes under a K, when he goes under a K. I need an armor break as well. I'm gonna swap to Yuna here. Should be able to get Titus up to full with a Cura. Well, close enough, I guess. I'm gonna swap in Kamari and Waka so I can get in a hit. They're the only two that haven't gotten in a hit yet. No, Lou dies from that, yep. They did announce a dub for that too, right? They announced they're doing a dub for that too, right? Okay. Bring back in Riku. Phoenix down. I should probably just overdrive with Titus here. No, no sense to like. I just isn't one character where like keeping overdrives doesn't matter. I 
fed you. Enough. Those rare drop is twelve point five percent. Let's go. Nope. That's a level two key sphere. I hope there's a, uh, I hope there's a, um, yeah, there is a save sphere in here. Does he have thrust kick? He does have thrust kick. Okay. Oh, it only unleashes thrust kiss kick if it's last. Okay. That, I just thought it unleashed thrust kick whenever. I know this is probably going to be boring to watch. But I need to do this anyway for the, the, the sake of being powerful enough. Oh. I'm actually gonna bring in Riku and cast Luck. Watch the you know and just here get him. Let's be safe. Let's play it safe. I don't think I've attacked his Waka yet. Or Lulu, for that matter. We are eventually going to run out of Phoenix Downs. Last punch can't kill, so I'm not worried.
I used men I used mental break, didn't I? I literally am just looking to grind that one encounter right now. Anything, I'm gonna run from anything that's not that encounter right now. Titus has already moved, I think, this game, this turn. No, yeah, he's ACA good. Well, Kamari... Rocket to get a hit. And then swap back in, Orin and Titus. Did I not... I didn't do Power Break. I did not do armor break. Grinding the specific encounter so that I can get level, a level 3 key sphere. So I can teach Lulu double cast once I get it. Farewell. No time to waste. Let's go. I don't think I used Riku. Yeah, I didn't use Riku. I am going to come back here to grind after the fact. After we're done with Yuna, Yuna Leska, to, um, to grind level 3 key spheres. It's also a great grinding place in general. Because we are going to need a lot of level 3 key spheres. We are going to need level 3 key spheres later on. Defender Z! Defend Give me a Defender Z! I can try to tell by, tell by the camera angle that they use, uh, which encounter you're getting. Yeah, using, using, using mental break is still worth it. It, like, doubles the damage.
steal a couple of lunar curtains, bring Kamari to do a hit, to do, to, to do a hit. Bring Iwaka to do a hit. Then I can swap those characters right back out. And I'm fairly certain Yuna did something. Yeah, I had Luna just attack. I had Yuna just attack, that's right. Which is fine. It's not, like, amazing or anything, but it's, like, at least gonna... She's at least gonna do something that way. And all my guys... And all my guys are hasted, so... See where we're at with his? Yeah. Come on! Oh. I wonder if we can bribe him for one. Oh, we bribe him for designer wallets, not uh not key spheres. And we need um eight hundred forty six uh thousand gil to do that. Again, fleeing from every battle that's on a Defender Z, right? Now. A Defender Z. Healing after every battle, we're forced to take damage in. We need this drop right now. And I'm just hoping that this doesn't take like the whole episode through the whole time I was looking to stream today to get this drop. Ugh. It's also not that we can't defeat them. We're specifically looking for a certain for a certain encounter. There we go. gonna cure Orin just for safety. This allows Yuna to get her get her 
th get her thing in while actually being useful. I am going to use Kamari's turn to top and unit it to heal uh, Orin again before I swap back into Lulu with whoever's turn with whoever's turn comes next. I don't mind doing that. Lulu's doing more damage than Titus is right now. I'm gonna swap in with Titus now, though. Nope, we didn't get it. Try again. It's only a 12% chance to get it, so... To get the drop once we get the, uh, once we get the, uh, encounter that we want. So, how shall we do this? I think Yuna's the only one who hasn't had a turn so far.
There we go. And units hasted, so this should be fine. Phoenix down on Yuna. Riku can get swapped out next time if he, if he has. Nice. That's how it's done. Please. Nope. We're gonna have a lot of level two key spheres. Probably more of this on the map at this rate. I just need one game. I just need one. Please. I just want one. I wanted you I wanna get double cast before I continue. That's all I want. Switch to Riku and Steel. Obviously, you have some really awesome items you can steal, too. We might end up doing our whole entire sim grind right here. At this rate. Going. There we go. There is absolutely nothing you can do to increase drop rate. Increase drop rates. Okay. I was going to be like, well, I'm going to use luck on Riku over and over again, but that actually doesn't do anything. Further Wiki was kind enough to tell me. I'd rather just use you in this turn to uh, heal. Orin. I don't know if I got a hit in with Walker or Kamari yet. So let's just be safe and just, uh...
Actually, just using attack seems like it's way faster. Nope. Reset my formation because Riku's fast, the fastest person we have. And I would love to s just steal stuff as I'm running away from these encounters that I don't want to do. of life do? Are they just like the... Oh, cast doom on an enemy. Okay. Double check in. Now, walk is who I'm going to use. Um, I've so, uh, we want to actually uh, armor break. managed to hit most of them around the good. He does already have armor break on, okay. <laughs> Kamari gets on the attack. Last punch can't kill, so I don't care. Rocka definitely, uh, so... Good there. Please let this crime be over. Fuck. I've now wasted 25 minutes at least. 
I've, I've, I've wasted at least a half an hour so far. And just swapping everybody in to do an attack so they actually get the experience. I don't think Riku and Yuna are the ones I don't think have gotten a, a move yet. I didn't get Waka. I Riku. Oh no, I didn't mean to do that again. Take that. That's fine. <sighs> I 
At least I'm getting a lot of them. At least I'm getting a lot of chances at this encounter. I think Rock is the only one who has another turn yet. Can you just continue buff? Continue just chipping away at him. Actually, can I delay Buster him? That would actually be better. Oh, he's he's immune to that. Okay. Enough. That's okay. I just need one level 3 key sphere. That's all I need. And then we can continue. Can't wait till I can actually like buy more stuff. Really use I haven't used armor break yet, that's fine. Pick Kamari, because I'm about to swap them out. No, that's fine. Can I actually use Wakas too? Now I'm mad. Cause I think I have walk on attacks too. I'm just looking to speed this up and then it is in any way possible. Twelve point five percent, chat. We're twelve point five percent every time we do this encounter to get that level three key sphere. And I just need one to continue.
I might end up having to stop after you know let's go. Well then, what next? No, just keep attacking. Lulu's turn, I'll swap to Riku, Ocean Titus, and then swap to Orin on, his, on her next turn because that'll be the, um, the least effect time affecting thing. Waka here. Riku's next turn, you can just swap that wiring back in. And just continue hitting A. Please. Please give me what I need. For fuck's sake. I've at least spent an hour on this now. Right now Riku and Titus need to turn. I forgot Kamari had it too. Actually, that should be my starting party. I should reform to that being my starting party.
Gonna swap out to Lou. Ty just dies like in a I just need one sphere. So be it. I think everybody went at this point. <laughs> Ugh, fuck it, whatever. No, I want I want Titus to get the experience. It's more important. The experience is still like important. you know Jeez. Not get any luck today. He's gonna kill Titus, probably. Yep. 
to switch to Kamari and flee. Kamari, please. Or it'd be preferable if you didn't hit any of us, but you know, you're gonna hit somebody, I guess. I just have Waka and Orin. They haven't attacked. Diego, the other two. No, oh, didn't mean to do that, but whatever. Last punch doesn't kill as usual, so it's fine. Oh, I should be using... Yeah, that's fine. I should have used Titus' overdrive, but that's fine. Oh god, I can't get this. As far as having to swap people out to like make sure everyone gets like credit for this battle. Doing an issue ring because it's probably the thing with the best base, atta base attack. I think it just ups the bone, ups the damage. You get all three. Oh, 
god. That's gonna make us more of a pain in the ass. Trying to have the three people with the best attack. No time to waste. Let's do go. most of the work. I'm getting frustrated at this. See no difficulty. Everyone who's not going to be attacking set a turn. Oh, it's intense. Um, well, what I'm trying to do right now is trying to get a level three key sphere so I can teach Lulu double cast. I've been grinding at this for an hour. That's what I'm currently doing. Because I want it for the two upcoming boss fights that I have. Hopefully you're lucky for me, Carrie, and, and I get it. Yes! Oh! Oh, finally! 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 Yeah, so that enemy drops it 12.5% of the time. Thank you, Carrie. I appreciate you. <laughs> I appreciate you coming into the chat and and being and being lucky. Cuz I already have a level 4, but I needed a level 3 to get to it. It's one of Lulu's best abilities is double cast, so I want it. But I'm not going to like I'm not gonna sit here and wait and like I'm not gonna have Lulu sit here and not gain continue to gain power while I was waiting for that. I gotta grind for some more later on, but
that should uh, so th so that grinding that I did should get everybody to the end of their to the end of their section. And if not almost. But like once we do this stuff Yeah, like, this is the end of Titus's section. I was gr no, I was, I was just like... I was like, just about to the point. Yeah, I... I played this- I played very early this morning, Carrie, I get you. My thighs are killing me, as well. Molly commented yesterday that I hadn't played in a while and I felt bad, so I, uh... So I played this morning and my thighs ate me. But now watch, I'm like too OP for Unaleska now, probably. It's fine, we want everybody to get to the end of their grid, like, right at, at this point, so it's, it's honestly fine. Yes. I mean, I've played this game before. As I don't remember what Quick Pockets does. Is it just like steel with like better speed on it? Imagine how good it would feel to overkill you in Alaska. I mean, sh I mean, yeah. And that will mean is because I'm definitely going to have to do some grinding in between this part and the next part. Which means as soon as I'm done today, I'll be sitting on the couch watching an watching some of the new anime with Molly. And doing some grinding. For, I don't think I'm going to grind for ultimate weapons in this run, but at least everyone needs, everyone needs their stats to be a bit better to fight Sin. Than what their stats are at at the beginning of the uh, at, at the begin at the end of their at the end of their um section so oh thank God this is thank God that grind is over. I am gonna flee from anything from here to the next boss though. twist you get out of my face I have fought so many of you I don't want to see you see you for a little while I am serious about fleeing every encounter from here until uh, the next boss fight because I don't think we need any more level sphere levels at this point. Uh, hey, Braska. Braska. You don't have to do this. Thank you for your concern. Fine, I said my piece. Well, I haven't. 
Lord Braska, let us go back. I don't want to see you die. You knew this was to happen, my friend. Yes, but I... I can't um, accept it. The Xanderkin trials are next. Oren, I am so it's fair, this. fairly close to I that, yeah. To kill grief itself. I will defeat sin and lift the veil of sorrow covering spirit. Please understand, Oren. I believe there's a boss fight before Unaleska, though. If I remember correctly. And at this point, I kind of do mean to kind of mean I'm going to flee every battle from to Unalesco. Because I grinded for so long there, I don't think we need another. I don't think we need any more levels. Obtained a Lux Sphere. Okay. Just like checking the cookmucks and crannies, because sometimes... I don't remember where every chest in this game is. Are the trials ahead? Probably. Here too, huh? Give me a break. I was expecting, you know, parades and fireworks. You can ask for them after I defeat Sin. I mean, Braska is right. You can ask for the parades and fire or Jim Muscle. Uh, oh yeah, I imagine Jet was like, "Why we got all these? Do all these dumb puzzles? These puzzles are dumb." Oh, I don't like this puzzle either. Plus, I don't. I don't remember how it works off the top of my head. We have to get the puzzle pieces that mat that correspond with the um, puzzle on the screen. That's right. Okay. I'm basically trying to find the ones that aren't right. So I know which ones not to do. Should be just those three then from Okay, yeah, I think I remember what we have to do here. We have to do this for all six of the uh, other temples that we were in, that we visited.
I know that one's not right. just gonna I would like to not sit here all day and have to do this. I have to just trial and error this. I think it's this one. Oh, I have to press A. Okay. Oh, bottom right. Sorry, I'm looking at the wrong one. to go. That one was wrong. This one, if you tell me you looked this up, I'm like, there is no shame in looking this one up. This one's such a trial and error puzzle.
that like it's really not a big deal to look it up. Related to nothing, I beat Nadam in 14 yesterday. That was a project. Oh yeah, I'm sure it was. I actually finally reached level 70 in 14. So, there's that. Okay, top right pedestal should be the last one of these we have to do. This one. This one. This one. One along this side. Yeah, I'm like almost at the end of Stormblood. From what I understand. Okay, here we go. I wonder why there's a save sphere here. I wonder, that's weird. It's not weird at all. There's a boss fight. <laughs> this guy's a joke in comparison to Unaleska. We want to position our characters. In such a way that everyone is like... Is like two away from each other. Honestly, fairly okay with some with with him having preserved.
I actually want to do this. She didn't actually get hit with the Zerk, okay. I wonder if this... Oh, I did fire for my second one. It does counter-attack every time you attack it. I know, she's berserk. Well, Orin's gonna die, and I can't do anything about that.
Riku. I can just haste the in here. I know, do you have to like... I gotta keep attacking it, even if it kills one of my party members, like, I gotta keep attacking it. It's really annoying that they, like, gotta do this cutscene every time this is a small cutscene every time. One of my dudes gets berserk. I just can't really take a hit right now is the problem. I should be able to tank the hit, okay? Perfect. And this counter attack's not gonna hit anybody. is gonna die but I can uh full life him with Riku.
Oh, he's not gonna die. Okay. This is a little bit more annoying than I remember. I don't know which one's where is the problem. Yuna's best move will probably be to heal herself. I can make a decision depending on who dies. Nice! I just doesn't get anything, but that's that's perfectly fine. Sir Oren, everyone. Okay. its power is a faith long ago. It is Lord Zeon, the first faith of the final summoning. What you see before you is all that remains of him. Lord Zeon is... his soul is gone. Gone? You mean, there is no final Aeon? But fear not. Lady Unaleska will show you the path. The final Aeon will be yours. The Summoner and the final Aeon will join powers. Go to her now, inside, 
The lady awaits. Yuna, wait! Aaron, you knew this was gonna happen, didn't you? Yes. Why didn't you tell... If I had told you the truth, would that really have stopped you from coming? Yuna. I'm not going back. Kimari knows. Kimari goes first. Yuna is safe. Kimari protect. Now we're going to go back and save again so we don't have to do the cutscene again. Congratulate you, Summoner. You have completed your pilgrimage. I will now bestow you with that which you seek. The final summoning will be yours. Now, choose. You must choose the one whom I will change to become the faith of the final summoning. <sighs> There must be a bond yep. between Chosen and Summoner, for that is what the final summoning embodies. The bond between husband and wife, mother and child, or between friends. If that bond is strong enough, its light will conquer sin. A thousand years ago, I chose my husband Zeon as my faith. Our bond was true, and I obtained the final Aeon. There is nothing to fear. You will soon be freed of worry and pain. For once you call forth the final Aeon, your life will end. Death is the ultimate and final liberation. Your father, Braska, chose this path. I turn back, who will defeat Sin? Would you have some other summoner and his guardians go through this? But... My lord... There must be another way. This is the only way we got now. Fine. Make me the faith. I've been doing some thinking. My dream is back in the other Xanarkand. I wanted to make that runt into a star blitz player. Show him the view from the top, you know. But now I know there's no way home for me. I'm never gonna see him again. My dream's never gonna come true. Oh, his dream was to make so his son into a star blitz ball player. Faith. I'll fight Sin with you, Braska. Then maybe my life will have meaning, you know? Don't do this, Jekt. If you live, there may be another way. We'll think of something, I know. Believe me, I thought this through. Besides, I ain't getting any younger, so I might as well make myself useful. Checked? What? You're not gonna try to stop me too? Sorry. I mean, thank you. Braska still has to fight Sin, Oren. Guard him well. Make sure he gets there. Uh, well, let's go. Lord Braska, checked. What do you want now? Sin always comes back. It comes back after the calm, every time. The cycle will continue, and your deaths will mean nothing. But there's always a chance it won't come back this time. It's worth trying. I understand what you're saying, Oren. 
I'll find a way to break the cycle. You... have a plan? Checked? Trust me, I'll think of something. <laughs> and he did, and his plan was his son. His plan is his son. One of us has to become a faith. I volunteer. Me too, Yuna. That still won't change anything, you know? You'd bring the calm, and then what? That won't break the cycle. Listen, you want to defeat Sin and keep Yuna alive. You don't want Sin to come back, yeah? That is just not gonna happen, brother, you know? If you want everything, you'll end up with nothing. But I want everything! Now you're being childish. I give up. So what would an adult do then? They know they can just throw away a summoner. Then they can do whatever they like. You're right. I might not even have a chance. But no way am I gonna just stand here and let Yuna go. And what... Oren said about there being a way? I think it's true. You'll think of something? Yes. I'll go ask you, Naleska. She's got to know something. You really think she'll help you? I don't know. But I have to try. You're there for a reason. This is my story. It'll go the way I want it. Or I'll end it here. Wait. You say it's your story. But it's my story too, you know? It would be so easy to let my fate just carry me away, following the same path my whole life through. But I know... I can't. What I do... I do... with no regrets. I should have went back to save because we die here. There's no save point. Have you chosen the one to become your faith? Who would it be? <laughs> Might I ask something first? Will sin come back even should I use the final summoning to defeat it? Sin is eternal. Every Aeon that defeats it becomes Sin in its place. And thus is Sin reborn. So that's why Jack became Sin. Sin is an inevitable part of Spira's destiny. It is never ending. Never ending? But, but, if we atone for our crimes, Sin will stop coming back, yeah? Someday it'll be gone, yeah? Will humanity ever attain such purity? <sighs> this... this cannot be! The teachings state that we can exercise sin with complete atonement! It's been our only hope all these years! Hope is... comforting. It allows us to accept fate, however tragic it might be. Yep. No! Where is the sense in all this? Braska believed in Yevon's teachings and died for them. Jack believed in Braska and gave his life for him. They chose to die because they had hope.
Yevon's teachings and the final summoning give the people of Spira hope. Without hope, they would drown in their sorrow. Now choose. Who will be your faith? Who will be the one to renew Spira's hope? Yep, now somebody no, else has to die. <laughs> I would have gladly died. I live for the people of Spira, and would have gladly died for them, but no more. The final summoning is a false tradition that should be thrown away. No, it is our only hope. Your father sacrificed himself to give that hope to the people, so they would forget sorrow. Wrong. My father... My father wanted... to make Spiro's sorrow go away. Not just... covered up with lies. Yeah, you know. Sorrow cannot be abolished. It is meaningless to try. My father... I loved him. So I... I will live with my sorrow. I will live my own life. I will defeat sorrow... in his place. I will stand my ground and be strong. I don't know when it will be, but someday I will conquer it. And I will do it without false hope. Poor creature. You would throw away hope. Well, I will free you before you can drown in your sorrow. It is better for you to die in hope than to live in despair. Let me be your liberator. Now, this is it. Here we go. This is the time to choose. Die and be free of pain. Or live and fight your sorrow. Now is the time to shape your stories. Your fate is in your hands. Yuna needs Kimari. Kimari protect Yuna. Well, I'm fighting. I can't believe we're gonna fight Lady Unaleska. Give me a break. You can always run. Ah. I'd never forgive myself. No way. Not if I ran away now. Even in death, yeah? <sighs> My thoughts exactly. Yuna! This is our story. Now let's, let's see, see this thing through together. together. Let's go. Let's not use Grand Summon until the end of the fight. armor break. So I'm assuming she's also immune to to um mental break too. Immune to slow, too.
We just gotta fight through it. screen. comes the second stage. So we need to keep at least at least one person zombied. I should have just used a remedy. God.
There we go, got it. Thanks for regening Orin. Appreciated. I can I can handle that for now. We need to have at least somebody have zombie on them at all times in case she casts Mega Death. Because if she casts Mega Death, we have no zombie status party members. We die. We lose immediately. I'm gonna switch Tatus out though. I can't afford for him to keep getting hit right now. I'm gonna switch Lulu out on her next turn too. Wait, did she just like get rid of haste on my dudes? On my guys? Why don't we have haste on us again? Alright, Riku needs to go away in case, uh, in case she casts Mega Death. Titus is gonna die here, but that's fine, I can swap him Riku and get him back up. Waka can be our zombie slave for now. Need to advance to the next stage.
We're, we're a long way away still. Hi, River Song, how you doing? Yeah, so that, like, counterattack that she does must, like... Li it, it literally must just include Dispel, like, in it. Because I don't understand how, like, we're losing Hasty Egg... How, um, how we're losing Haste. I want to keep Riku in reserve. I don't want to have her out. In case I need a Mega Phoenix, I would rather have, uh... I would rather have, um... I would rather have her in reserve. Just in case. Here is where, uh, having double cast is gonna do a lot of good. I'm trying to get her into range to, to die to a, uh, Mega Flare. And if you're a zombie, you you dodge Mega Death. We're getting close. I might, I might try to go for the Mega Flare after this. Seventeen. I want to get her to fifteen before I try. Okay, now we're doing it. Now we're going for it. She either kill her or get her really close. Do I attack once for safety? I think I'm gonna attack once for safety. And hope he doesn't cast Mega Death. Hope she doesn't cast Mega Death during her turn. Fuck. You gotta be fucking kidding me. You gotta be kidding me. You can't write this. I thought you said something, sorry. Can't write this. I literally like didn't attack for safety so that so that she would die to a mega flare. Now I waste, I wasted Yuna's, uh, I wasted Yuna's overdrive because of it.
And actually dispel the regen on me. On the end. He's pretty close to dead other anyways, but like she would have she would have like like guaranteed been dead to Mega Flare after that attack. Oh great. You've got to be close to dead, right? Like, uh, like a double cast plus a hit from Warren should 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 kill her at this point. That did it. Uh, I made that more stressful than it had to be. <laughs> I accidentally made that more stressful. <laughs> by like... By being like, oh yeah, we'll safety attack before... We'll safety attack if before I hitting die, Mega Flare. So does the final Aeon. You're already and dead. with it, Spira's only hope. Then we'll find Spira a new hope. Fool, there is no other way. Even if there was, even if you did destroy sin, you, Yevon, the immortal, would only create sin anew. You, Yevon? Ah, oh, Zeon, forgive me. Spira has been robbed of the light of hope. All that remains is sorrow. He's like barely wearing any clothes, it's weird. I, I can't imagine a convention that would allow somebody to wear that those, that little of clothes. I cannot believe what we just He basically did. is naked. Let's do something more unbelievable. Let's kill Sin without what? the final AM. Destroy Sin. So it won't come back. And without the final Aeon. I don't know how just yet, but I'll find out. I, I I literally cannot I literally cannot imagine a convention that would allow somebody to wear that little. Okay, so the sun crest for Titus's ultimate weapon is around here somewhere. Where is the sun press? It, it, it's in this room. I don't want to leave the room by accident. Yeah, Lulu's cosplay is fairly, uh...
I'll have to re I'll have to rebeat we it and load the save and reload the what? save. There's something you should know. Get it. I know. It's about you, right? I am also an unsent. You are not surprised. I think I kind of knew. It was Unaliska, wasn't it? When Braska and Jack No, I didn't died, find it. It's sin. fine. I'll um I just couldn't accept it. I am planning on ending in a minute anyway because there is a grind them. that is needed but she struck before, me down. before we start sin. Somehow I made my way crawling down Mount Gagazette. But my strength left me just outside Bevel. That's where Kamari found me. I told him about Yuna just before I died. I've been wandering ever since, never going to the far plane. Aaron. Don't make that face. Being dead has its advantages. I was able to ride Sin. Yeah, I figured out it was far back. Like, and it said in the back, so I was like, over me since then, haven't you? It was in the back, so I was like, oh, okay, like I guess I have to go back. What's the big idea? Why me? It is one of those things that is difficult to explain. Very well, I will show you. My memories. It, it's fine. Can I ask you one last favor? Uh, nah, never mind. Out with it. Well, Final Fantasy okay. 10 so Listen much back in the good. day that I could kill Sin in like two hits. Yeah. Take care of my son. Uh, my son in Xanarkand. He's such a crybaby. He needs someone there to hold his hand, see? Take care of him, will you? But how am I supposed to go to Xanarkand? Because of his two horns, <laughs> yeah. Hey, you said it yourself. There must be a way to get there, right? You'll find it. Uh, all right. I will. I give you my word. I'll take care of your son. I'll guard him with my life. Thanks, Oren. You were always such a stiff. But that's what I liked about you. It, it's fine. The boss ended up being like... That is why. Yeah. We're at the end of everyone's, like, sections. So, like, it's, so, like, it, it's fine. I'll, I'll end up going back and redoing the fight. Anyway. Um. I'm fairly donezo for today. For today, I am, I want to go get some stuff done. Um, before... Before I do stuff, we go. So, uh, what we gonna do? We gonna raid my friend Sarah, Lady Tuesday. If you've not, if you've not, um, if you've not seen her before, she's a great streamer, uh, with a great community. So, she's actually one of my IRL friends, actually. So, um, so, plus I'm literally going over to hang out in there anyway. So. Go say, come say hi, watch some Kingdom Hearts 3, um, and I'll be back tomorrow morning at like 10. Hopefully I've done some grinding and we can try to finish off the sin parts of this game. We'll, we'll, we'll see. We'll see. Depending on how much I'm actually able to do. May do some grinding on stream before we do that, but I'm hoping next time can be the last stream of this game, but we'll see. Um, actually done, done this game way faster way faster than I've ever done the game before so you know if you'd like to see more of that you know just you know follow and we'll see you tomorrow for